welcome back. Today's video is just going to be a quick session on the live stream that they had today, March 3rd. The Sims 4 team showed off everything coming in the new Infants Free base game update, which is coming out on March 14th. It's a little less than two weeks from now. So there's going to be a ton of new Infants themed furniture, anything from cribs to decoration to toys, lamps, rugs, and other decor. Um, there's also going to be outdoor items like baby gates that you can use to keep children in or out of certain areas, and it's baby proof. Also, some of the new features include having a science baby, which is some sort of like surrogacy program. It can either be with Sims that your Sim is already connected to romantically, or it can be with random Sims that they know. The science baby kind of forgoes the pregnancy process. So, infants are going to have their own unique set of traits. There are six traits unique to infants. Cautious, sensitive, calm, intense, wiggly, and sunny. And these traits influence how they behave and how they respond to their caregivers and the world around them. So these six traits can also be enhanced upon with 18 quirks that are required through natural gameplay, progression. And so there's a ton of new stuff in cast for infants, anything from clothes, uh, for male and female types, uh, new hairs, glasses and accessories, hats, uh, shoes, diapers, just all of everything that you can think of that you would want for your infants. Some are going to be exclusive to the expansion pack and then some are coming free in the base game. So again, for this live stream portion, it was for just the base game updates. We're also getting uh, birthmarks, stretch marks, and other skin uh, tags that can be used for anything infants and up. So there are going to be some basic functionalities added to the base game for infants, including the ability to give infants a bath in the bathtub, using this little bathtub like chair thing. It keeps them kind of up and floating in the water. You see there's a lot of interaction with that, you know, playing with them, testing the water, you know, playing with toys. It's very cute. I think that this is one thing I noticed with this live stream is that they're adding back the little touches to The Sims 4. This reminds me a lot of The Sims 2, which is one of my favorite games in the PC Sims series because there was so much that you were able to see and do with your Sims. And then the final part that I thought was super interesting was the ability to taste test different foods and textures with Sim infants. There were more features that were going to be base claim exclusive. These are just the ones that stood out for me. If you want to go back and watch the full live stream, it is available on the Sims official Twitch and YouTube channels where you can get a better view of what's coming for free. But again, this is going to be base game content coming on the 14th. And you see they fixed the high chairs where the Sims don't automatically snatch the kids out of the high chair and not let them actually eat. So I'm very excited for this patch and I think it's going to be very worthwhile. 